The dynamic field of artificial intelligence, AI, holds the key to transformative changes across a wide range of sectors, promising to redefine the global economic, social, and technological landscape. Yet, the burgeoning potential of AI has primarily been harnessed by the developed nations of the Western world, leaving countries in the global south and BRICS nations at a pivotal crossroads. The need for these regions to invest in AI is not merely a matter of keeping pace with global advancements, but a crucial step towards ensuring their autonomy, economic resilience, and the tailored application of AI solutions to meet their unique challenges and aspirations. Recognizing this imperative, several countries in the Global South and the BRICS consortium have begun to take decisive steps towards developing their AI capabilities. For instance, AI-driven technologies in agriculture can significantly enhance crop yields and predict weather patterns in countries where farming is a critical part of the economy. Similarly, in healthcare, AI can play a pivotal role in improving diagnostics and patient care in regions where medical resources are scarce. In this video, we explore how investments from countries in the global south are challenging the United States' dominance in the field of artificial intelligence. Before we proceed, we encourage you to consider liking the video to show your support for our channel. Additionally, we invite you to share your thoughts in the comments section below. Your feedback is invaluable and will help us reach a wider audience. Thank you for your support. China's growth in AI is not limited to regulations alone but extends to its applications as well. The country is undergoing a technological metamorphosis, particularly in the enterprise software sector, heralding the birth of new enterprise software industries. These budding industries are projected to generate significant economic value, estimated to be about $80 billion, with a sizable share anticipated from cloud and AI tooling. Additionally, local AI-based software-as-a-service (SaaS) applications are contributing appreciably to this economic boom by deploying AI across an array of business operations. The healthcare and life sciences sectors are also on the forefront, with increased AI investment driven by the government's 14th five-year plan. Under this strategic blueprint, a 7% annual increase in R&D expenditure is targeted by 2025, with AI applications in the aforementioned anticipated to unlock substantial economic value, specifically in areas like drug discovery, clinical trial optimization, and clinical decision support. Nevertheless, there are hurdles to overcome, most notably in gaining access to cutting-edge technologies amid intensifying U.S.-China conflicts. Recent U.S. measures limiting chip exports to China could impact the AI sector, as it heavily depends on chips from abroad for computational tasks. However, these hindrances have not derailed China's unwavering determination to advance its AI capabilities, backed by strategic investments in various sectors, thereby solidifying its standing as a formidable contender in the worldwide AI arena. This evolving scenario perfectly illustrates China's dual strategy of implementing meticulous AI regulations to address risks and ethical issues, while simultaneously making aggressive investments in AI technology and applications across diverse sectors. This equilibrium reflects China's ambition to not just lead globally in AI, but also adeptly navigate the intricacies and harness the potential that AI offers. In the wake of China's remarkable progress in AI, Russia too has made significant strides in the domain, particularly in its military applications. Russia's pursuit of AI signifies a crucial step towards modernizing its defense capabilities, with a unique set of challenges and strategic focuses that differ from Western advancements. Key priorities for Russian defense include enhancing command, control, communication, and decision-making processes, deploying unmanned vehicles, developing nuclear and high-precision weapons, and focusing on air defense, early warning systems, electronic warfare, space-based systems, and cyber and influence operations. The National Defense Management Center in Russia is reportedly utilizing AI to support information collection, analysis, and decision-making, underlining the emphasis on integrating AI at all levels of decision-making within the armed forces. Over 100 types of unmanned vehicles were tested before the 2022 invasion of Ukraine, showcasing Russia's ambition in AI applications in the military sector. However, Russia's AI development faces obstacles, primarily due to structural issues like insufficient funding, corruption, inefficient resource use, and stifled competition and innovation due to a reliance on state orders. Educational and research infrastructures also seem inadequate for high-tech development, 
further hampering innovation. Despite these challenges, Russia's military modernization efforts continue, underscoring the need for AI technologies in future weapon systems and the overall structure of the armed forces. Russia's military AI approach aims to debilitate adversaries' command, control and communication systems to gain information superiority. This strategy involves substantial investments in AI and machine learning for electronic warfare, unmanned systems, and information warfare, with the goal to enhance intelligence, surveillance, reconnaissance capabilities, and ground-based fires. Despite Russia's challenges, including lesser R&D spending compared to the US or China, and reliance on foreign semiconductor technology, the potential use of AI-enabled technologies to undermine US and NATO interests should not be underestimated. As we delve deeper into the world of AI, it's evident that the race is not just about technological superiority, but also about strategic positioning and geopolitical influence. In the unfolding narrative of global AI, we now turn our attention to the remaining members of the BRICS bloc, Brazil, India, and South Africa. These nations, rich in diversity and potential, are making strides in AI development, recognizing its transformative power across various sectors. In Brazil, AI is primarily being applied to automate repetitive tasks, boosting productivity, and creating new job opportunities. Brazilian tech companies and startups are exploring AI's potential in fields like agriculture, healthcare, and finance, aiming to drive economic growth and improve public services. India, with its vast population and technological prowess, is leveraging AI to tackle its unique challenges. The government's AI for All strategy aims to democratize access to AI technologies, focusing on sectors like healthcare, agriculture, education, and smart cities. India's IT giants and a thriving startup ecosystem are playing a pivotal role in AI development, contributing to the country's ambition of becoming an AI powerhouse. South Africa, the continent's most industrialized nation, is harnessing AI to address issues like poverty reduction, healthcare accessibility, and climate change. The country's commitment to AI is evident in its National Artificial Intelligence Institute, which aims to drive AI innovation and position South Africa as a leader in AI on the African continent. The BRICS nation's collective efforts to boost foreign direct investment reflected in the rise from $84 billion in 2001 to $355 billion in 2021 underscore their growing significance in the global economy. The establishment of the New Development Bank further emphasizes their ambition to foster economic self-reliance and support sustainable development. With the expansion of the BRICS bloc to include nations like Egypt, Ethiopia, Iran, Saudi Arabia, and the UAE, there is potential for increased AI research and development collaboration. This move could pave the way for a more diversified global AI landscape, with each member contributing unique perspectives on AI ethics, governance, and policy making. As we delve into the intricacies of AI investment and application within these nations, we realize that their collective efforts are likely to shape not only their economic trajectories, but also the broader dynamics of global AI development. That's all for this video. We invite you to like this video and share your thoughts in the comments below. As always, thanks for watching and stay tuned for more insights on global finance.